All right, and welcome back. I'm Bo Lorenzen, the FPV guy, and as you know, I've been roaming around here at NAB 2016, mm -hmm. and right now I'm at eHang. I know eHang makes an inc some incredibly big drones, like one-seaters, or is it two-seater? It's one-seater, one -seater, yeah. One-seater. I want to test drive one of those as long as somebody else flies it first. <laughs> and I'll take the video from the ground, and I'll call that a test flight. But more down to the earth and less, actually I think the big one is cool. What is that product number? It's uh, the 184. The 184. So one passenger, eight motors, four booms. That's basically how they came up with And that. my life insurance refused to let me fly it. <laughs> but more down to earth for consumer oriented drones, we have a couple right here and let's say you have one there and here's another yeah. one, they come in white and black. White and black. And tell me a little bit about this product. So they also, besides the colors, they also come in two different packages where you can get either this way with our 4K spherical let's camera. Let's get this up to yeah, the camera so we can see. So Absolutely. This one is uh, called the VR. It would also include our uh, VR goggles, actually. Uh, so, then, so this is a this is a 180 camera. Uh, yes. You said it's yes. a spherical camera. Yes. Spherical. So this sees the full goggle, the full sphere. Uh, no, I mean we we named it the sphere because of the round shape. That okay. Is, yeah. So because we also on the other model we have. What our is the field camera. of view roughly on this? Uh, 98. 90, so that's 98 degrees, which is very reasonable for an aerial camera. Sure. And this, you've got a smart battery in it. Right. You've got 5.8 down, and, and you were mentioning the price for the smart battery is fairly reasonable. Yeah, it's just $99. It's, 99? Yeah, yeah. Okay, and why are these not twist-ons? Uh, they are twist-ons. These are twist-ons? Yeah, yeah. yeah, they're, they're self-tightening. Oh my goodness. Yeah. But you have a so, you have a hole for that's the if, if they happen to get stuck. I yeah, actually sure. like that because yeah. there's more than you once I've had a hard screwdriver time through there. And, and, yeah, absolutely. Oh, so that's, that's nice. These are twist ons, and now one of the most interesting features here is, of course, that these comes with a VR headset. Correct. Yeah. That's so the VR, you would get the the goggles with it, and the way this works because we don't have a transmitter. You don't we actually, have a, yeah, we don't have a transmitter. We so use wait, wait, wait. your cell So phone. I need to buy myself a transmitter from somewhere else? No, 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 no. Everyone has a cell phone, right? It's smartphone okay. control. Okay, yeah, but a smartphone does not go 500 yards out. Right, so now what we've done is what you would do Let's is you actually... So can yeah, actually a little bit closer this. to the camera there. A, a lot closer. <laughs> so these goggles have actually a 2.4 transmission out. So what you would do is you actually link your phone to this via the Wi-Fi. And then this would trans, you know, transmit out your 2.4 signal to the copter for the controls, and then you have your 5.8 signal coming back with your video. It's okay, as so as that. so I connect to my phone with Bluetooth, with and I have an app, Wi-Fi connection to my phone. Right. Okay, that's better than Bluetooth. Yeah. And I have an app on the phone, and then the con app sends a control via Wi-Fi to the right. goggles, so and the goggles are a repeater that then does a 2.4 connection to my aircraft. Exactly. exactly. And then video comes back down using the 5.8, and yeah. it appears you've got diversity on here. Right. Yes. That's a pretty nice setup. And there's a little... That's a forward-facing camera, so there's actually a view switch, so if you tap that when you still have them on, then you're looking straight in front of you. So you can see who that funny sound in front of you comes from. <laughs> right. Some homeless people getting ready to mock you. <laughs> yeah. So, okay. And this thing, now what if I want to tilt the camera down? Okay, so this actually does have head tracking. And so if you do want to pan your camera up and down, it's just as simple as looking up and down with your head. So basically, and this is really what is setting this apart from the other Phantom clones. And it's really not fair to call it Corrupter a Phantom clone anymore. Right. Because four motors does not necessarily make it a clone of a Phantom. Right. right. But you're controlling it with an app directly you're controlling it repeating through the goggles right. to the aircraft and you've got head tracking built in. Right. So that's not something I have to set up after the fact and solve buying any components. Nope. So there you have it guys, it's a whole new concept. This thing come, is born to be flown with an app. The goggles are actually your control link and the goggles comes with built in head tracking so that if you're doing real estate video and you're coming in and you want to tilt down and see a feature, the camera is literally going to follow your mind of the way you move your head. Yep. Now, so for all of this goodness here, with the goggles, the repeater, the camera, which is 4K, I'm assuming? Yep. Yes. What am I looking at? $2,000? No, 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 no. Yeah, it's actually about half that, actually. It's going to be $1099.99 or $1,100.
$10.99.99. I think it should be $9.99.99. That sounds better to me because I'm the one paying. <laughs> yeah, I agree with you. Yeah, absolutely. So, so there it is, $10.99.99 for the quad, the goggles, and of course the app for a 4K camera system ready to fly. That's correct. New product, eHang, and what is this product called? This is the Ghost. The, the Ghost e 2.0. The eHang Ghost 2.0, not yeah. the 1.0, obviously. No, nope, this is the 2.0. With head tracking, and it's available shortly from dealers across the U.S., including, of course, carolinadrones.com. So stay tuned for more NAB 2016 videos as we continue our walk around NAB 2016. And say, One more thing we wanted to talk, uh, mention about the Ghost 2.0 is... Uh, we actually announced a new warranty for it that uh, it's uh, basically a one-year no-fault warranty. So what that does is it actually covers you for the first three accidental crashes. You send the drone back to us, we repair it or replace it, send it back to you. One year? Now, for, well, yeah, so you three times. You guys don't know me. <laughs> this this t-shirt actually used to say, been there, crashed that. <laughs> well, so good. guys, this, this actually puts this product in a whole different box. One year, no fault warranty. Nobody else is doing that in the industry. So stay tuned, we're gonna bring you some flight reviews of this Ghost, and we'll let you know how this really flies. Stay tuned, make sure you subscribe today, and more videos coming shortly.